going to get up out of here. Some of us are trying to fix it ourselves with a saw that's not running. But if you have the word of God, vroom, the Lord is my light and my salvation. Vroom, they that wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. Vroom, I can do all things through Christ that strengthened me. Vroom, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not walk. Vroom, he may not come when you want him, but he's always on time. Vroom, do ever with this. Ask and it shall be given. Seek and you shall find. Knock and the door shall be opened. the neighbor said vroom faith family and friends i know you are just as excited as i am to be here at this moment and time to celebrate with our pastor and teacher dr td stubblefield and sister judy stubblefield for their hard work dedication and service right here at fbcc and to the surrounding community we have some family, friends, and loved ones that have reached out to us, sent in a video, and would like to share with you their expressions of love. Thomas Darrell Stubberfield and the lady of your life, Miss Judy Stubberfield, I want to congratulate you all on this 20th anniversary at First Baptist Church of Chesterfield. Likewise, I want to congratulate the both of you on coming to this point of retirement as pastor and first lady of the church where I announced my calling some years ago. I want you guys to know that the entire Gaines family is so very proud of the both of you guys. It's been a blessing to watch you from near and far as God has used you mightily to touch the lives of so many persons. Uh, to you, I wish the very best in your days of retirement. I know you're not retiring from ministry, but operating now without the pressures of pastoring. And so I send you off with the best the Gaines family has to offer. Our prayers, our love, our grace toward you, letting you know that we love you guys. And once again, we are so very proud of you and all you've been able to do. May the Lord bless you real good. Hello, Pastor Stubblefield and Lady Judy. This is Roger Burton, the pastor of New Northside Missionary Baptist Church. Myself and the congregation want to bless you and salute you on your retirement. We love you, take care, enjoy. Pastor and Judy, hi, this is Chief Stephen Lewis of the Ellisville Police Department, formerly of the Chessville Police Department. I just wanna take this opportunity to thank you for your mentorship and your friendship these many years. You have truly been someone who was sent to me from God, and I appreciate all the help you've given me over the years. God bless you, thank you, and best wishes. Grace and peace be multiplied to you, to my good friend and brother, Dr. T.D. Stubblefield, to Sister Judy, and to Minister Darrell, and certainly to the ministerial staff at the First Baptist Church of Chesterfield, the deacons and trustees, and to you, the people of God. What a joy and what a privilege it is to have known uh, Pastor Stubblefield to be in our city to minister for these 20 years. What a blessing. My friend, I am so happy and elated for you in terms of what God has in store for the next chapter in your life. Yes, that's right, because this is a sign that the sun is going down on this chapter, but the book is not over. We thank God for you and for what you've done. Wait a minute, I got a phone call. Man, I always get a phone call at a time when I'm busy, and probably this person doesn't even want anything. Let's see. Hey man, what's up, what's going on? You okay, all good, all is good, okay. What's going on? Hmm? Pastor Stubblefield, he's retiring. What do you mean, Pastor Stubblefield is retiring? Retiring from what? Retiring from the pastoral ministry? Retiring from the church? Oh, man, I, listen, I'll talk to you later. I'm talking to Pastor Stubblefield right now, and I haven't heard anything about him retiring. Pastor Stubblefield, I told you they didn't want anything. They're telling me that you are retired, but I believe that you are really redeployed. 
Let me explain to you because redeployed is a little bit different from retiring. Retiring just simply means that you're going to absolutely do nothing and you're going to do what you want to do when you get ready to do it. But you are redeployed because I believe that God still has some more sermons that he wants you to preach, some more lessons that he wants you to teach, some more books that he wants you to write. And God has many more mountains that he wants you to climb, many bridges that he wants you to cross. He still has more work for you to do. And so God bless you real good as we see you in the next chapter. Pastor and Sister Judy, what a blessing you all have been to the Edwards family, Devin, Tyler, Bobby, Kaylin, my wife, Sharice, and of course myself. Uh, Pastor, uh, 20 years ago, I remember uh, being a little boy and playing the drums, uh, accompanying the choir uh, as we uh, sing and worship. And I remember you being installed as the pastor. And never would I have imagined that I would grow to uh, such height as I have. Uh, and uh, that would be under your leadership. I love you and I thank you so much for all the support, encouragement, and guidance you provided me uh, over the years. Uh, it's been a blessing and to now be entering into the ministry under your tutelage and under your guidance is such an honor. So we thank you so much for just your love and your commitment uh, to us over the years and we know God has great things in store for your future. Please, Pastor, Sister Judy, come back and be with us anytime. You are always welcome, as you already know. We love you guys, and we just wish you well. God bless you. Because if you trust him, if you hold him, if you walk with him, if you talk with him, if you let him have it, he'll work it out. The writer of Hebrews said, he's the same God yesterday, today, and forever.